Okay, yep. Like you imagined. This is Spencer Man. I'm sitting at my desk. And this will be how to make a paper origami fortune teller. So, if you, if you have a rectangular piece of paper, you will need scissors. But if you have a square piece of paper, you won't. So, right now I have a rectangle. And what you're supposed to do is turn this rectangle piece of paper into square. So, how you do that is you... like this mm. rectangular piece and fold it like that there so now if you see this line this line you're going to cut cut down like this It used to be this, and now it's this. So then you're gonna open this triangular piece up. Then what you're going to do is take this one. Yeah, okay, so what you're going to do is fold it into a half. Well, this is my way of making it. I can't believe I'm showing you how to make it. I kind of forget, but you should not end the video. Okay, so once you have this, you're going to fold it like this. Then open it up. And that part you just did wasn't necessary. If you see this line, and if you see this line, you are going to take this and fold it there. You're going to do that. Fold it to the center and do that to all the sides. Mm. Okay, so it should look like this. And then what you're going to do is turn it around and then do this. So you turn it around and then you fold, you take this corner, then you fold it back to the center. There. Fold it back to the center. Now it should look like a diamond or a cobra. And then you do the same thing to all of the sides. I used to know how to make one, then I forgot, and then I came back to knowing how to make one. And that's the story of paper origami fortune. Goodbye. The end. No, I'm just kidding. Okay, once you have this, you are going to take this. It should look like this. You're going to take it and then fold it to the center. I mean, no, not fold it to the center. You're going to take this and fold it into a half. Yep, and it should look like this. This is what it should look like. And then you kind of do this, and then you put your fingers inside the holes. Describe if I did not explain well, and I could probably make a new video. Either. Wait. So, look. 
so so what we did is at first it was like this and then you put your hands inside here and then turn your quarter so you may need to make it more into shape okay that's the end of the video subscribe if i did not explain good and we'll probably make a new one